Hello everyone, welcome to Inside Android. So today we will talk about checkbox and switch. So let's start. You might have seen those in the many in many other apps. Today we will see basic operation that can be performed on switch as well as on checkbox. So let's just start. okay so this is done and here we have our java file and here is our xml file we should wait till it loads as usual we have got here a text view constant layout so first i'm going to remove the text view then here what i'm going to place is checkbox i'm going to lift it up and drag and drop on here here I can give it ID checkbox is already given and now what if uh, suppose if I want to change the text let me just zoom it suppose I want to change its text from checkbox to remember password so here is our attribute text and I can change it to remember password and as you can see the text is changed in my real app I can click on it to save my password uh, but here it's just for demo and we will not be performing any other operation on it so here is the app uh, so here is the checkbox other thing which we are going to use is switch so I can just type your switch and here is the switch and I can put it here and the same thing here suppose I want to change the text so I can change the size, uh, not size, sorry. I can change the text to on or uh, I can change the text to settings. So we can assume that this is a checkbox which will show or hide our settings. So these are the two elements which we have added in our layout checkbox and switch now I'm going to show you how you can use them in the in your Java file first of all I'm going to show you of checkbox we have to copy its ID control C in main activity I will define it by checkbox and here I will type checkbox equals find view by id uh, dot id dot checkbox now i have to find now i have to put a listener on this checkbox so to put a listener on it we can type checkbox dot set on check change listener and here okay so here is the thing so now when I have written this code it gives me a thing boolean b and this b shows if my checkbox is set to true or false. So what I will do is if uh, I can put a listener here for example if b equals equals true then I want to show a notification of then I will write true or else else if b equal equals false I can give a notification or I can give a toast of false okay so now we can check it in our app okay so now what we can do is we can also put a listener on our switch this switch so to check this switch first I have to copy its ID in my main activity I will define it as switch and here I can here I will have to write switch equals find view by ID 
okay so as you can see i have defined it as a switch here i have attached its id and now i'm going to assign a listener over it so to assign a listener i will write a switch dot set on now here's the part i can use check change listener over it so when i will click on it i will give on check change the same way we can use the same method we can apply on checkbox as well as on switch and this was the reason that i wanted to explain both of them in a single video so i can what i can do is i can just copy it from here and i can paste it so if on uh, if our switch will uh, is set to true it our not our toast will show true or else if it is false then it will show false so just uh, let us just check it 